In the history of Europe, the Middle Ages, also known as the medieval period between the 5th and 15th century, began with the fall of the Roman Empire, which had merged into the Renaissance and the Age of Rediscovery. The most important architectural representative of this period was a church building. Roman churches were divided into Western Roman Catholic and Eastern Roman Orthodox after the fall of the Roman Empire. The construction technology in Western Europe has been drastically declining compared with ancient Greece and Rome. Structures were slow to develop and its glorious arching technique had been lost. This was not recovered until the 10th century. This had revived the Roman architecture known as the Romanist style, mainly using the Latin cross style basilica and had gradually developed into the later Gothic architecture. The architecture of Eastern Europe was more developed compared to Western Europe remaining the construction technology of the dome. The Orthodox Church had proclaimed that the believers are more intimate and the centrally constructed architecture of the dome is suitable for the doctrine. Therefore, this kind of building was gradually increasing in terms of use, called the Byzantine architecture. Byzantine architecture was an architectural style that was mainly used in Constantinople or Istanbul after the year 330 AD. The Byzantine influence is built as a continuation of the Roman architecture with their most distinctive feature being the domed roof. The central dome-shaped structure and its magnificent interior reflect the authority of the spiritual rule, unity of politics and religion. There are great achievements in the creation of Byzantine architectures, from iconic paintings, mosaics, inlaid stone pavements, murals, miniature paintings, and crafts. As the foreign enemies successfully invaded, the land was reduced and less buildings were constructed, with the scale of being not as big as before. The buildings are characterized by a smaller land with the higher builds. The central dome had disappeared and changed to several small dome groups with a focus on decoration. St. Mark's is the cathedral church of the Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Venice, Northern Italy. It is most famous of the city's churches and one of the best known examples of Italo Byzantine architecture with a Greek cross and five domes. Romanesque architecture is a term that describes the architecture of Europe which had emerged from the Dark Ages of the late 10th century and evolved into the Gothic style during the 12th century. The Romanesque style in England is more traditionally referred as the Norman architecture. Romanesque architecture is characterized by its massive quality, thick walls, round arches, sturdy piers, groin vaults, large towers, and decorative arcading. Each building has clearly defined forms and symmetrical plans. The overall appearance highlights the simplicity when compared to Gothic buildings that are to follow. The style can be identified across Europe despite regional characteristics and a range of different materials. Gothic is a style that flourished in Europe during the High and Late Middle Ages. It evolved from Romanesque architecture and was succeeded by Renaissance architecture. 
Originating in 12th century France, it was widely used, especially for cathedrals and churches, until the 16th century. Its most prominent features included the use of the rib vault and the flying buttress, which had allowed the weight of the roof to be counterbalanced by buttresses outside of the building, giving greater height and more space for the windows. Another important feature was the extensive use of stained glass, high-rise windows bringing light and colour to the interior. Another feature was the use of realistic statuary on the exterior, particularly over the portals, to illustrate the biblical stories for the largely illiterate parishioners. These technologies had existed in Romanesque architecture, but they were used in more innovative ways and more extensively in Gothic architecture to make buildings taller, lighter and stronger. An important characteristic to Gothic church architecture is its height, both absolute and in proportion to its weight, the vertically suggesting an aspiration to heaven. The increasing height of cathedrals over the Gothic period was accompanied by increasing proportion of the wall devoted to windows until the late Gothic influence. The interiors became cages of glass. This was made possible by the development of the flying buttress. This had transferred the thrust of the weight of the roof to the supports outside of the walls. As a result, the walls gradually became thinner and higher, and the masonry was replaced with glass. The four-part elevation of the naves of early cathedrals such as Notre Dame was transformed into the choir of Beauvais Cathedral to very tall arcades, a thin triforium and soaring windows up to the roof. Reims Cathedral incorporated several new architectural techniques, notably the bar tracery. Reims is richly decorated with elegant masonry sculpture, particularly the exterior and exceptional stained glass windows, making it one of the most artistic masterpieces of the French High Gothic period. <laughs>